Hello and welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Chelsea and for today's video we're going to go in and do a review on the small brilliant tea fighting trays. Um, ignore the fact that I've got a full face of makeup on because this will be the next video. But um, yeah, so for today's video we're going to go through the process and my thoughts on some tea fighting trays which is very exciting. But I just want to say a little disclaimer, this company did email me, they did um, gift me the products to do a review on um, but that does not alter my opinion at all because you know I'd rather say what I actually think um, yeah so this video is a little bit all over the place because I did video random steps so um, when I got the tea fighting um, paste and then you've got to make your moulds I videoed that bit which would be the next clip um, and then I also done a little clip on um, when I first received the trays and how to do it, putting them in, etc. So I've been doing this process. Um, I started on the 18th of June. I haven't done it every day because my teeth did get quite sensitive. Um, and I spoke to the lovely lady who got in contact with me originally and I did say about it. And she said, take a few days off, which I did. I took the weekend off. So it's sort of been pretty much every day, but not every day for the past two weeks. Um, and I've still got a little bit left over as well, so I'm going to continue to do. But anyway, so basically this is an American company. Um, the teeth whitening kit retails for $149. When I first got told that, I'm not going to lie, I don't have that money to pay on teeth whitening kits which is why I've never really got them done. But if you do want to get your teeth whitened and you want to go to an actual professional and pay like hundreds and hundreds of pounds, I suggest trialing this first because this, I think is really good. Um, so yeah, so they're basically at home kits are similar to what dentists use when you actually pay hundreds and hundreds of pounds or dollars. Um, so yeah, so I was very, very excited to try this because my teeth weren't really bad, but getting yellow and quite yellow and some, especially like towards my back teeth, my back teeth were quite yellow. Um, and I don't know if it's because of what I drink and, and what I eat and things like that, that it, obviously it's, your teeth get stained. So unlike other teeth whitening kits, this doesn't bleach your teeth, um, not to the point like I've tried, um, what is it, the Crest? teeth whitening kits and they bleach your teeth. I've tried it but that made my teeth very sensitive. Um, so yeah, and the only other things that I've tried are like the new skin tooth whitening paste or the or other basically toothpaste pretty much. So I've never actually tried a kit like this so I was very intrigued as to see what the results were. Um, so now I'm just gonna go to the next clip and this is basically what I received first of all, to get the process started. See ya. So these are my finishing trays uh, for top and bottom. It took me a couple of attempts to take it because there was just way too much paste in the tubs. So I suggest that each of the tubs you've got the base and the catalyst. If you've got a small mouth like me, then just use half of each because otherwise it was just way too much. It was making me gag and it wasn't my teeth wasn't sitting properly. Um, so yeah, so now I've got my trays. All I've got to do is wait half an hour for them to proper set and then rinse it off in water and then I can get ready to send it back to the lab um, and then that's when they will send me my trays and then I've got all of this um, teeth whitening gel and desensitising gel 
um, so just little syringes to stick onto the trays to then start the process. So I'll update you as soon as I get the trays back from the labs. See you in a bit. Hello, so I thought I'd just jump on it quickly because obviously I'm vlogging this experience. And I've just received back my Smile Brilliant teeth trays. They're different to what I expected, but in a good way. They're actually like, they're like silicone moulds of my teeth um, from obviously the blue trays that were done. So now I'm going to start the process of whitening my teeth. So as you can see, my teeth don't look too bad, but they're not as white as I'd want them to be. And obviously these, I've seen such good reviews, so I'm really excited to try them. But yeah, so basically you get... Um, a Smile Brilliant Desensitising Gel, which you put on afterwards, and then you get obviously the teeth whitening syringes. Um, I think each syringe could probably do a couple of days, um, but yeah, we'll try. So I thought we'd just open it up together. So you're meant to brush your teeth with water only, not toothpaste, and obviously you can't eat or drink for a few hours. But you meant to leave this on for between um, 40 minutes and 3 hours, I think it says. Right. So make sure your trays are completely dry, which they should be because I've just got them out of the thing anyway. And there's your syringe. Oh, I've not done anything like this before. Right, so you've got a cap that you just take off so you can open the syringe. But make sure you don't lose it because you reseal it afterwards. Put that there. So you just put a little bit which is a thin line I'm pretty sure. Okay, so there's one tray. Can't really see if it's clear. I just put a thin just a thin line on front. So put that there a sec. I'll also do this one. This is my bottom trays. Feels like I'm doing an injection of cow or something. Okay. So then my syringe is done. So pretty sure this is my bottom teeth, yeah. Oh god, I'm scared. I feel weird, but I need to stay on. <laughs> so yeah, so now I'm gonna go watch Love Island. Keep that on for, I'm gonna keep it on for about an hour for my first time. But yeah, I need to get off. I saw it look like a state, but. <laughs> okay, right, see you in the next video. Right, so we've gone through the first package I received. We've gone through the second package, um, because I lived in the UK, it did take a lot longer for me to actually receive the teeth whitening trays um, after I sent off my mould. So I, I think I did wait a couple of weeks. Yeah, I think it was a couple of weeks, um, which was okay. Like, it was fine. That's all right, as long as they got to me safely. Didn't mind that. And obviously, when you're in the UK, so when you pay that lump sum, um, and you're in the USA, all your postage is covered. But if you're international, like I was, then um, they pay for them to send to you. So obviously they're sending you two lots of packages. So you paste and then your trays. But you do have to pay the postage for you sending back your moulds, which only cost me, I think it was five pounds. So yeah, so not a lot. Um, but then they, they cover the other postage costs which is fine um so yeah that took a couple of weeks when i got back tried on the trays and basically what i, I would do is i would do it just before love island to come on because religiously everyone at the moment is watching love island so of course i'm gonna watch love island and i like to do it before bed because um when you do the teeth whitening trays you get desensitizing gel as well and you put that on for 20 minutes and then you just rinse it off and yeah bob your uncle 
but when you go to bed you're obviously not eating you're not drinking and then the desensitizing gel the residue will then help your teeth a bit more because my teeth do get very sensitive that's the only thing um when i've done it every day um i've done it every day for a good few days and then well it was for a week and then it got to the weekend and i didn't do any on the saturday but i did eat ice cream my teeth never been sensitive before never um but i did have a sharp pain in my gums and i don't know if it was definitely from the teeth whitening and stuff but it's never happened to me before my teeth started getting a little bit sensitive so i spoke to the lady who I um, my contact from Smile Brilliant and she said it's absolutely normal, it's just your teeth getting sensitive, just use some desensitizing gel and just take a few days off, which I did do. Um, and then as soon as I started doing it again, so basically I had the weekend off, as soon as I started doing it again it was absolutely fine. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to insert little clips of um, my teeth before and my teeth now. And I've still got about a week's worth of application because the syringes, they're, they're meant to be like um, three to four applications per syringe. I got quite a bit. I got five to six. So, happy days. So I'm still going to continue to do it. And hopefully, I get even better results about this product. It's just stripping back all the tea stains and all the other stains that are in the teeth back to their natural colour. If you're looking for a natural white, which I think is better than obviously this would be the product for you. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna insert these little clips of my teeth before and my teeth after. So just a little overview, you brush your teeth but just with water, no toothpaste, you put in your trays, you do it for a maximum of three hours, but I would only do an hour, just over an hour, depends on how long Love Island was on for, and then take your trays out, rinse them out, and then put the desensitising gel in, do that for 20 minutes, then rinse that out, and then go to bed. That was my routine, um, dead, dead easy routine. Um, so yeah, overall, I'm really happy with the results. Um, I've noticed a difference. Um, a few people have noticed that they're just making it your natural white teeth. Um, so yeah, and I'd had like discoloration, especially on the sides, which are going now. They're not completely gone, but I've still got another week's worth yet. So hopefully with that, they would have gone. I've seen so many good reviews in this product, so if if you're after a teeth whitening kit to do at home, then I'd definitely, definitely recommend this product. Um, like I said, it did take a, a bit of time for it to re like come back to me when I sent the mould, so don't panic. But the moulds fit perfectly, like actually perfect, because <laughs> when I was actually doing it, it, I had a nightmare. But it worked absolutely fine, and I've still got two paste left, um, because I've only got a small mouth, I didn't, I didn't need that much paste. But obviously, if people got big mouths, you're going to need all that base. And I'm, I didn't use as much of the syringe because, like I said, I've got a small mouth. So, yeah, it is, it is a really good kit. I do recommend it. And, yeah, I'm happy with the smile and I will continue to use the syringe. That is my conclusion. Thank you all for watching. Uh, let me know if you do buy this kit yourself. Um, and I've got something special coming up on my Instagram page to do with this teeth whitening kit. So please, please keep an eye out for it because it could mean a giveaway. But yeah, more details of that will be over on my socials soon. Um, but thank you for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Hit the subscribe button and I shall see you in the next video. Which will be when I do this makeup look because obviously you're dead excited. Okay, thanks, bye.